A measure making its way to the governor's desk looks to limit oversized commercial vehicles on the fast lane. Yeah, lawmakers say it's meant to keep slower traffic out of the far left lane where faster vehicles usually are. Max Rodriguez has details in a story new tonight at 9. A measure that could affect truck drivers and other large commercial vehicles is close to becoming law. State senators and representatives voted to pass a bill prohibiting oversized commercial vehicles from using the far left lane if there are three or more lanes on the roadway. We've got a lot of interest from the public who I think are frustrated sometimes that you have slowdowns in the left lane uh, when you're driving down H1 or other major highways. So the bill really helps try to clarify who should be where on our road. The proposed law says this would apply to commercial cars weighing 10,000 pounds and above. If you can remove those who are a little bit slower sometimes into uh, you know one of the right lanes, that just lets everything move a lot more quickly. There are some exceptions carved out in the proposed law. One if the commercial vehicle driver is able to keep up with the current speed of traffic, and two, if they're using the left lane to pass another car. The Hawaii Transportation Association Managing Director says they originally opposed the bill, saying previous versions were too restrictive by not including language allowing commercial vehicles from using the left lanes for turning or exiting. That's now been added. And making sure that uh, our guys who can keep up with the traffic are still allowed to utilize the left lane, and again, without impeding the motoring public. He suspects if the bill becomes law, truckers and other commercial deliveries will have to factor in at a time, especially if the type of cargo prevents them from using the left lane. So we have to be there in the mornings, whether it's construction, bakeries, restaurants, you name it. The governor has until June 26 to inform the Hawaii legislature if he intends to veto the bill. Max Rodriguez, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.